Hey guys, I usually wouldn't do this two video thing, but I had to give a video this morning because I was just so pumped about, you know, my w early morning wake up. Um, yeah, so right now it is 8.40 p.m. Pacific time here in San Diego. Um, I just completed my night workout. Now I had, I ran into an issue today. Well, let's go over the day. So I did that workout this morning. Um, I decided to try to eat small meals throughout the day. Um, at work, they had this this cool posting up that um, you know about fitness and stuff. They do this monthly calendar, and I think I've known this before, but I thought it was a cool little fact. It's sticking in my brain that um, it says, "Why do you get so tired after a big meal?" Well, I guess it's because um, you're using most of your oxygen to digest your food. That big meal you just had, so it's less oxygen to the brain, which makes you tired. So you should eat little meals you know, throughout your day. So I'm trying that out and it's working really well and I'm never getting to the point where I'm hungry, um, except today with my little incident, but I'll explain. So anyway, um, I wanted to go over the food I ate today. So this has been key. It's not fun and it's, it's a pain in the butt to do, but you need to get one of these bad boys so you can write down all of your food intake. Very important. Just a small little guy carrying my, my little lunch bag when I carry it to work. And since my roommate was awesome and made all the meals for the week, um, really keeps me on track, by the way, Linda. I love it when you do that. It's good stuff. Um, it's very helpful, and it makes me stay on track, and she even counts calories and stuff. So I'm just going to go over what I ate today. So 7 a.m. after my workout, I had a breakfast wrap that she made. It was freaking amazing. It was um, a low-carb tortilla with um, – it had two egg whites, one egg. Um, there's mushrooms, green peppers, and she put this chicken sausage, which has a lot of protein in it. So um, I know Jillian said last night in Biggest Loser, you need a lot of protein, especially after your workout, so you can rebuild back your muscle. Um, 9.30 at work, I had um, almonds, but I've been getting sick of almonds lately, just eating them plain. So I added in some raisins in my little mix. So good. So good. So if you're getting sick of almonds, too, and trying to eat almonds all the time, Good stuff. It was about 200 calories. Um, 11 a.m. I had another snack. This sounds like a meal, but it wasn't. It was on those little flat, um, like hamburger buns that are 100 calorie. They're the multigrain ones um, with turkey and a piece of cheese. It was 230 calories um, with a little bit of the olive oil, mayo, and mustard. Um, for lunch, I had at 1 p.m. two hours later a small salad and a piece of string cheese. Uh, 4.30 p.m. I had 100 calorie yogurt with an apple and for dinner I know it's late right now 8.40 but I had a long day um, I won't be eating till probably about 15 almost 9 o'clock which is bad but um, I need to eat dinner <laughs> so um, it's spinach lasagna and of course I'm gonna have a skinny cow after because I just love dessert and I have to have something and those are you know 140 calories so I'll have that so my total calorie count for today, 1645. I really don't know if that's good or not. Like Jillian was talking about to one of the girls at 1200 calories. Did you guys hear that? With like burning 6,000. I know they're on the biggest loser ranch, so it's a little bit different, but um, 6,000 calories to burn in a day. Holy crap. Um, my water intake has been awesome. So far, I've actually drinking 88 ounces of water. So I've been drinking water all day long, keeping hydrated. Um, I also, in the middle of the day, I wanted to get up out of my office chair. Um, I got one of, I got my manager actually to, we did lunges all around our, you know, pretty big office and it was burning. We looked like big goofs, but um, it was fun and we burned calories. So I might add that to a little daily thing and maybe every hour do something kind of fun around the office. Um, yeah, so on my way home, um, to the parking lot from work, I was excited. I was head, you know, gonna head to the gym. Um, I got a flat tire. <laughs> yeah, so I was driving around and I'm feeling, why is my car slanted to the side and why is it making this weird noise? Um, I was actually on the phone with my roommate telling her I was going to the gym and when, when I noticed that the car was happening, you know, or car was happening, the noise was happening. Um, luckily I was still in the parking lot. I pulled over, security came outside and they actually popped on the spare tire which is you know when you're going on the freeway at 55 miles an hour because that little <laughs> spare tire 
um, people aren't too happy. So that was fun, and that took hours out of my day. I really didn't get home until, um, what, 7, 7.30 or 7.45. So I was already exhausted and really hungry by that time since I ate at, you know, what, my last was 4.30, but it was an apple and, and yogurt. I was supposed to be done by my work, with my workout by that time. So um, when I got home, um, my gym closes at 9, so... I had to do that wee cardio workout again. It was good, but and I wasn't gonna do it, but luckily my roommate, she forced me to because I had my head set on it all day. So that was good motivation. Um, all right, so the game plan tomorrow, I'm waking up early again, trying to wake up uh, by five this time to um, do my morning workout. And tomorrow I have something called lager lessons. So I'm gonna be drinking beer. This was planned like last week or two weeks ago even, so I wish I didn't even plan it because beer has a lot of calories so I'm a little bit nervous about that then we're going to a happy hour after so I'm gonna try to be good all day long and eat maybe less calories throughout the day get a good workout in the morning and hopefully I'll feel better about these lager lessons <laughs> I'm excited for them but it's gonna be a little rough all right folks head out take a shower and I'm gonna eat a late dinner talk to you later <laughs>